Well, I wanted to do a quick video of my, uh, well, wood slash electric cook stove with the water jacket hooked up to a range boiler tank, which you can see off to the right. So on this side, we burn, we started it with wood, primarily burn it with coal. Um, I see there's a nice coal fire going in there right now. And uh, it does provide, it provides a decent amount of heat um, for the kitchen. And then also it heats up that water jacket, which I have tied in to this range boiler tank, which is, ooh, that's getting kind of toasty. Um, that's plumbed in with, uh, yeah, if you can see it, let me grab a light. By the way, these things, these Ryobi lights, these are worth the money. Um, this is an older one, of course, but anyway, you can see how I have that. The uh, lower line is the cold water uh, that goes to the, the water jacket in the back here. And then the upper one is the hot water, which goes up to the top. It's just completely what's called a thermal siphon. It is completely gravity. Hot heat or heat rises, cold sinks. So that's exactly how this works. The water jacket itself, let's see here. It's that little box right there. That's full of water that transfers everything. Looks like I need to clean some crap off of it, but that's that's what gets hot, and that's what heats this up. So from this thing, it just uh, out of the top is the hot water coming out. Yes, that's a PVC pipe painted silver because I was just broke when I put this thing in. Uh, I was tried something as far as like putting a block heater on this thing to see if I can like at least keep it warm when it was 90 degrees outside I didn't want to want to light a fire but this is my primary hot water tank so yeah and then out of the tap let's see here See if we can get, get show us some steam here or something. Not quite hot enough yet though. Yeah, there we go. It's getting. Oh yeah. Yep. See that steam right here. Probably about 120 degrees. So, well, there you have it. Um, the the uh, stove or the range, rather. This is a majestic. I got it for a hundred bucks off of Facebook Classifieds. And uh, the electric side over here works really well. Um, I don't exactly have proper electric service at this place, so I just ran a 20 amp service over to the plug. So, as long as you're not running all four burners at once, it it does the trick. Um, in the oven, it gets warm off of the uh, it gets warm off of the fire, obviously. And uh, has an element at the top there. I think there's supposed to be one at the bottom, but I don't exactly see it. Um, you can shake the grates with the coal here. Empty the ashes here. There's a damper right here. Um, I'm missing the bottom panel on this thing, so I don't really know what's supposed to go there. Storage off of this side. So yeah, pretty cool unit all all together. Uh, it's been piped into the original brick chimney. Um, let's take a look at uh, how much this thing's polluting. Not too bad, all things considered. So, well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye now.